Whatever you want. That's it. That's all you have to say. What do you want me to do? Beg? No. I know you wouldn't do that. Are you all right, love? Yep. Are you sure? Because it's divorce. Why are you still here? I'm just saying. I mean, at the very least, it's expensive. Might be able to help you out. Just go! No, come on, just hear me out a sec. Charity, perhaps you should go. It's just this, this job and... All right, I'm going. <sighs> Another time, yeah? Another time. I'm sorry. Okay. Victor, if you ask me if I'm okay one more time. Holly, would it kill you to remember to tell me when we've run out of milk? Or, you know, buy some yourself? Oh, Holly! Although I did drink the last of the milk, sorry, I'll pop it. So I can forget it. Kane. I shouldn't even feel like this. I shouldn't waste my time feeling anything for him anymore. Well, it's easier said than done. Winds me up so much. What's happened? I told him I want a divorce. Right. And do you? No, of course not. Really? After everything he's done? Yeah, stupid, I know. Yeah, frankly, I think it's insane that you've got any kind of feelings for him. Well, that's why we have to do this. Because I can't trust myself not to forgive him again. He's gone too far this time. I can't take him back now. Pleasure, Moira. And congratulations on getting one over on me again. What are you talking about? Well, I never got round to marrying Kane, did I? You've managed to marry him and divorce him. I mean, how can I compete with that? Well, you're welcome to him, Charity. I'm pretty confident you'll be desperately unhappy together. Me and Kane? Nah, that's old news I've moved on. Plus, he's kind of damaged goods now, isn't he? Excuse me. Ignore her. I usually do. Come on, I'll buy you a coffee. Well, I should be buying. Make up for me whinging at you all morning. <laughs> Now, if you're thinking of getting physical again, well, guess what? I've got witnesses this time. Just goes apart. Well, what if I don't want to serve you? Well, I think you will. And whilst I'm drinking it, you... Why don't you tell me all about this job you were talking about? See you were listening, then. Hey, I don't like being summoned at the best of times, but if you're not even going to bother to show up on time... Oh, shut your yap and you love it. Bye, Charity. I'm joking. All right, I'm sorry. I'm sorry that I was late. I need you, all right? I'll owe you one. I'll be nice about you to Debs. Just anything to shut you up and do me a favour. <laughs> Not that you dirty little Debs. No, I'm, I'm not joking. Saying that. I'm joking. Chill your boots. Just come and sit down, please. I'll make it worth your while, yeah? Coffee. Got coffee? No. No. Well, fine, thanks, Rodney. You know, I don't know how it worked with Bob, but when I'm in charge, you want to stay here, you uh, order something. Fine, OK, well. Give me something that'll take you ages to make, yeah? And in there. Oh, uh, well, what's the most expensive? Summer soother or detox delight are both fairly intricate. Smoothies? Uh, yeah, I'll just have whatever the hell the second one was, yeah? Detox delight. If you say so. Coming right up. I mean, who even drinks smoothies anymore? So I've just spent the last five minutes waffling on to Kane about a job that doesn't even exist. And? I need you to make it exist. A job. For me and him, not you. <laughs> 